The Lord be with you. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Jesus said to the crowds, The kingdom of heaven is like a treasure hidden in a field which someone found and hid. Then in his joy he goes and sells all that he has and buys that field. Again, the kingdom of heaven is like a merchant in search of fine pearls. On finding one pearl of great value, he went and sold all that he had and bought it. The Gospel of the Lord. As Jesus describes the kingdom, he also describes the effect the kingdom has upon us whenever we're in its presence or it resides within us. As he says, the one who finds it, then in his joy, he goes out and does things that are changed in his life so dramatically that he sells everything he has. But the first effect of the first fruit is the joy in his heart. And just to reflect upon that and see the similarity with Moses, whose face shines in the presence of God, so much so that he needs to put something over his face when he's talking to other people. But to see the effects of the presence of God in his life and the presence of God in our own lives and the joy that it spawns within us and the joy that we can share with others. Brothers and sisters, let us stand and offer our petitions for our Mass today, those that are in our hearts as well as those who are joining us on the live stream. For all these intentions, we pray to the Lord. And we pray for the special intention of this Mass, for the intentions of Nora Ford. We pray to the Lord. Let us pray for all of our elderly, all of our grandparents. We pray to the Lord. We pray for all of our unemployed, especially those who suffer from anxiety with their families. We pray to the Lord. We pray for our Holy Father, all of our bishops, all those in positions of leadership in our